Hey there, Photo Booth Nook team. This is Pleasure from my Amazon guy. And I'd like to congratulate you on receiving your high star ratings and um, your Amazon Choice badge. I know that the category you're in is really competitive. So seeing this is a job well done. By the way, I want to talk about some potential enhancements that you may want to consider. And I'd love to share some strategies to grow your traffic and conversion, as well as improve your overall product listing. Before we talk about your product legal page, let's talk about traffic first. What drives traffic to our listing are keywords. So I have pulled up your keyword distribution, and it's good to see that you're paying for advertising. This is the fastest way to grow your sales on Amazon. We recommend you target more keywords as we recommend a 1 to 2 golden keyword ratio for better traffic and conversion. That means one sponsored for every two organic keywords. Now, organic indexing, on the other hand, gets you free exposure without spending on advertising. Might as well take advantage of this and index to as much keywords possible. I have looked at some of your competitors too, not to do product comparison, but to just uh, look at your, their strategy. We have Echo Xiao here with over 300 sponsored and 3,500 organic keywords. That's way more keywords than you have. Now let's take a look at how your keywords are performing by sorting this out from the most searched keywords. And here's your sponsored and organic ranking columns. I can see blank spaces, which means you are not being seen for a lot of keywords at all, which is a missed opportunity. You want to be seen at least organically, especially to these keywords that have that or with the, the highest traffic, as this is for free. Also, um, I've noticed that you're not being seen in top rank to keywords you are paying for, and this could be hurting your ACOS, so you may want to optimize this. Organically, we want to be in the top 50 listings to be on first page, as that's where 90% of clicks and conversion happen. But I can only see one keyword here showing you on first page, which is photo booth frame. To a lot of them, you're already on higher double to triple digit rankings, which means that your page is D from Amazon search results. Now, for example, we have acrylic picture frame, a highly relevant keyword for your listing with 3,200 searches, but you rank at 293rd, which means that these people would first have to see 292 other listings before you. So this is already hurting your sale. I'll look at Amazon too to see how much revenue this keyword has generated over the past 30 days. And there's $1.1 million for the top 50 listings alone. You are not getting any of the share because you're not ranking well for this keyword. So clearly, you need to up your strategy by utilizing your click-through rate and conversion. Your competitor from Echo Xiao, they were able to sell 1,900 units generating $15,000 and that's because they've got better exposure. You were able to uh, sell more than 200 units only. Now, what we can do to help you close the gap is perform a keyword gap analysis, and that's where we duplicate keywords that have the highest search volume into your listing. We also want to look at your top 10 competitors, including this, to pick the high-performing keywords from them. We can get you this keyword expert for free and give you a more detailed competitor analysis when you book your free consultation. Another thing that we'd want to help you with is your strike zone keywords or those ranking 20 through 50, meaning they're already at the bottom part of page one and not really benefiting you well. So our goal is to help you lift them up to the top 10 rankings for better visibility and traffic. We can also get you this keyword expert for free. And we focus on this in the third phase of our four-phase SEO strategy here at My Amazon Guide. Moving on to your front end listing, you've got really nice images, main image in plain white background, and some infographics. You've got lifestyle photos and a video too, but you can also add here your human avatar or your target demographic for your product. That's going to help you build connection with your consumers. Also, that has been proven to improve conversion. Next is title and bullet points. These are the best areas for keyword indexing. Make sure to add five to seven bullet points here to talk about your product while minding SEO. And also, you can maximize your title to up to 200 characters. So you can see here, your bullet points is zero. You need to add at least five. You also have to update them regularly as SEO is not set and forget. Now, if we scroll down, we can see you have your A-plus content, really good images. However, I've noticed that your texts are not crawlable. They're embedded on the images. So we can maximize this by adding crawlable text. Let me show you a good example. This is from our founder, Stephen Pope, Age of Sage. Now, this is their A-plus content right here with great images and then crawlable text. So you can have 500 to 1,000 words of copy and load it with highly relevant keywords. You can also have your product grid like so and alt text behind your images where you can put your common misspellings, Spanish keywords, and other keywords you want to rank for. You can also have this brand story 
where you can talk about your brand and showcase others of your products to increase average order value. We highly recommend you maximize the benefits of these modules to help you not just with conversion, but also with keyword indexing and advertising. Those are just a few tips from me. And if you want to hear more, take advantage of our free consultation and we can discuss this further. Here at My Amazon Guy, we're a 400 person full service brand accelerator. We do everything to grow your Amazon business. We manage all pillars of Amazon and give you peace of mind knowing that your business is handled well. Thank you so much for watching this video and we look forward to showing you more opportunities. Bye for now.